Good morning, Calvary, and Happy New Year. Pastor Chad here with your word for the day. And uh, today I want to talk to you about uh, transformation. You know, next week we're starting our Transform series here at Calvary, and we'd love for you to be a part of that uh, through worship, through life group, through the daily devotions provided by the Transformed books. Uh, and, uh, and so I wanted to share with you today, and in fact, uh, staff all this week are going to be sharing with you how we desire God to transform us in 2021. Uh, so when I wrote this question and kind of challenged the rest of the team, uh, the scriptures that came to my mind are Psalm 1, verses 1 through 3. And the psalmist writes, Blessed is the man who does not walk in the counsel of the wicked, or stand in the path of sinners, or sit in the seat of mockers. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and on his law he meditates day and night. For he will be like a tree planted firmly by streams of water, uh, producing fruit in its season, its leaf does not wither, whatever he does prospers. And, and I, I thought of that because for me, 2021, I want it to be a year of learning. Uh, I know some of you are thinking, a year of learning? Uh, aren't you old? Yeah, I'm 58 years old. I've got three degrees. I've got a bachelor's in Bible. I've got a master's of divinity. I've got a doctorate in ministry. Uh, but the reality is uh, I'm a disciple of Jesus. And the word disciple doesn't just mean follower, it means learner, student. And so I want to just kind of lean into even more uh, kind of that whole learning from Jesus. Uh, the things that he wants me to, to, to learn, the, the person he wants me to be, so that I can lead Calvary, so that I can lead my family, so that I can lead my life as a follower of Jesus Christ. And, and I'm, I want 2021 to be a year of learning because we set this God-sized goal uh, last year of reaching 4,000 people in Havasu and Parker with the gospel uh, by 2028. And for that to happen, we need to learn how to be better at communicating the gospel to our communities. We need to learn how to serve our community even better. We need to learn how to represent Jesus through our character even better than we have been doing because we want to see God work in amazing ways. And that means that we need to yield our full selves to him. That's why I'm excited about uh, Transformed as a series, because I think it provides all of us a chance to learn more about God, about ourselves, and about how we can become the men and women that God created us to be. God bless, and again, Happy New Year.